the sound man is an artist. He is out there, or she, is out there adding to the band's art. Same as what the drummer is adding, the guitar player is adding, the sound man is adding. The technicians that work in this industry are basically artists without an instrument. Working in live entertainment, what you're working in today may not have anything to do with what you're working in tomorrow. The equipment will be the same and you have to fit it in the same keyhole that you worked in yesterday, but the door may be completely different. It's a very simple system, but that's what makes it fast and fast is what you're after. You know, you get in fast, you get out fast. I have found that the compact wide line array of QSCs fits this bill so well. Oh, it's extremely easy. Once you drop it in on top of the cabinets, it's got a female receiver that the knuckles slide up out of the internal rigging on the cabinet. They pin in, and then it's just a matter of raising a group of four, sliding another group under, pinning it in, raising a group, sliding a group under. It's all about the quick in and quick out because time is money. And that's about right. The faster you can get this on the truck, then the faster you can get a beer. <laughs> so God is not saying to you to sit around and wait for heaven to come knocking on your door. <laughs> but he saved you for a reason to serve him. We work in probably 70 church jobs a year, plus or minus. I think last year was more like 80. Music is very, very important. Music is, the message is the meat and potatoes, but the music is, is the icing in the cake. If, if this sound system goes down on Wednesday night, this thing has got to run on Sunday, or somebody's coming to hunt for us. We sell promises of performance, and we sell reliability. We, we just, we don't install products that fail. And we have a company rule, literally, that if we have a product that fails on two jobs, no matter what it is, it doesn't go into another job ever. That's why we do, do the business for QSC, we do, because we have great faith that we're getting products that aren't going to come out the box and turn into lemons. As long as I can remember being in this business, I've had at least a QSC amp or two in a rack, always. It's just always been that way. They're a staple. Uh, I was surprised when they came out with speakers. I remember seeing the ad in one of the trade magazines, and my jaw opened, and I went, what the heck are they doing? Well, they're making good speakers. You know, that's what they're doing. They're the right size. They go together well. I like the fact that there's no wood in them. I want out of speakers what I think every engineer wants. They've got to go up quick, they've got to sound great, take a minimum amount of fussing and come apart quick so you can do it the next day. Rooms are tough and they really can test an engineer. You know, some gear takes a lot of massaging with uh, your crossover or equalizers. This gear doesn't require quite as much attention. Uh, I find that when you turn it on, you're in the game. It allows you to be creative and not feel as though that uh, you have to get it right before you can really start your job.
Casino Mulcahy. I'm the lead audio engineer for the second largest casino in the world at Mohegan Sun here in Connecticut. When you're in charge of life safety for a property and background music and paging and communications for people other than musicians, you can't fail. Money is not an object here. Money is important, but the right product is more important. This property is run on the back of QSC, be it speakers, networking, amplifiers. I chose this box because it works, and it does what it says it does, period. And the Big Easy is a place where, where people can go and have a good time. We, we cater to all, all types of folks. We built this from the ground up. We built it with production in mind. And um, we've done about 130 shows this year, 130 concerts, all mostly national acts, a lot of local acts as well. And we do dance nights uh, two nights a week. We're doing our job. We're, we're turning this room as much as we can. Well, the thing that's important in our, in our venue is that we have all sorts of artists come through here. We'll have blues, jazz, everything from uh, Buddy Guy and G-Love to Slayer. So we needed a system that could uh, perform under all those circumstances. We needed something that was uh, fairly flat from top to bottom and full with enough punch to handle hard rock and roll, which is hard to do, I think, in, a, in an array system. But the QSC Wideline rig has totally provided that. And a lot of the guys will drive in in their trucks and they'll have their own rigs, you know, and they've already predetermined that they're going to fly their speakers. And we'll get them in here and we'll fire up our system. We'll say, just before we do the work, can we just listen to the system and, and see what you think? That's a, big, that's a big challenge to overcome is to make the road guys happy. But everybody accepts it and we have not had to take it down in a year of operation. The artists are very happy when they, they come here. And I guess more importantly, the audio engineers that mix them are happy. You know, you want the audio to be transparent. It needs to be everywhere and it needs to sound great. And it needs to be so great that people don't think about the system. They, they think about the artist. audio we have an obstacle to overcome and it's called the listener who thinks they have uh, a responsibility to share with us their opinion on the sound. We have a setup where we, we play rock and roll music for our band. It's, it's all very great worship music. There's just this frequency range that tends to get really harsh in church music. It tends to make people mad. So what we're looking for is a loudspeaker that really is as transparent as, as possible. Me, as, as an impartial advocate for my client, I want to be able to provide them the best system they can have at the lowest possible price. So I've used QSC amps forever. So when I found out they had a speaker coming out, I thought, wow, that's an amp company. I knew QSC, I trusted them, and when I heard the loudspeakers, uh, I knew they would be good for a lot of my projects. My response when Dale came to me and said, let's try QSC speakers, was let's have a demo because, you know, I'm skeptical. They rigged them from our ceiling like they would be in, a, in our auditorium. That was huge because we could sit there and hear them and it wasn't in some perfect studio, it was on our stage. QSC is very good about sending product out to the reps to set up for this. Once I heard the demo, that was the ball game. And I said, well, this is a no-brainer, let's do it. It just doesn't kind of work, it really works. It sounds great.